August 17, Monday of the 20th week in Ordinary Time A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Matthew A young man approached Jesus and said, Teacher, what good must I do to gain eternal life? He answered him, Why do you ask me about the good? There is only one who is good. If you wish to enter into life, keep the commandments. He asked him, Which ones? And Jesus replied, You shall not kill. You shall not commit adultery. You shall not steal. You shall not bear false witness. Honor your father and your mother. And you shall love your neighbor as yourself. The young man said to him, All of these I have observed. What do I still lack? Jesus said to him, If you wish to be perfect, go. Sell what you have and give it to the poor, and you will have treasure in heaven. Then come, follow me. When the young man heard this statement, he went away sad, for he had many possessions. The Gospel of the Lord He went away sad. Persons who meet Jesus and interact with Him usually walk away in high spirits. Those who hear Him teach, bestow healing and forgiveness, and witness His incredible miracles always feel ten feet taller. Not the young man in the gospel. He wants to follow Jesus and have eternal life. When Jesus prods him to keep the commandments, the man claims he has kept all the laws consensuously. The man has spent all his life thinking what he could do for God. Now Jesus wants him to allow God to do something for him. Jesus challenges the rich young man to strip himself of all his possessions and give the money to the poor. Jesus does not pose this challenge to everyone he meets. Zacchaeus, a wealthy chief tax collector, will voluntarily give up his accumulated fortune. The same thing happens to Matthew, another tax collector who becomes an apostle and evangelist. One does not gain eternal life by doing something special for the Lord. Eternal life is a free gift. God gives it to us as we surrender our life to Him. Jesus is calling us to a life of wholehearted allegiance, nothing less.